Well, it's a two-for-one special today. I'm joined now with two sophomore forwards. To my left is Chris Berry from Ashburn, Virginia. To my right is Troy Nelson from Naperville, Illinois. Guys, how are we doing today? I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. All right. How about yourself, Cam? Oh, I'm doing great, as always. Two different roads, guys, to get here, but one similar similarity, New Hampshire. Troy, you played your junior hockey in New Hampshire, and Chris, you played some prep school hockey in New Hampshire. Chris, let's start with you. Talk about that a little bit. Well, I played at New Hampton School, so it was pretty fun. Um, actually, I had a brief moment in the EHL. A brief moment, a very brief moment. But, um, yeah, so played for the rival of his team, so the New Northern Cyclones. So I guess that there's another connection there with New Hampshire. Troy, you played for the New Hampshire Junior Monarchs before coming here. What was that like? Uh, it was pretty fun. Um, I already knew going in there, like a little bit of experience with uh, my older brother, Sean, playing there. Um, the beauty of it too was, uh, I mean, I, my grandparents lived out in New Hampshire, so the whole experience with playing juniors out there compared to anywhere else was uh, pretty fun. So you guys are sophomores now in your, in your second year, obviously, at the college. Were you guys roommates last year or no? No, no. So, so not roommates last year, but roommates this year. How's that been? It's been pretty good. It's been fun. <laughs> pretty, pretty good. How Did you guys know all along that you guys were never be roommates this year? Or kind of how, how did it formulate last year? Uh, I'd say like second semester when you're starting to figure out who your roommates are for the next year. Uh, I don't know. We just kind of came along with uh, Kyler and Boyd, and uh, we kind of just figured it out from there. It's, yeah. it's kind of clicked from there. <laughs> so you guys met last year. What was your Chris? Let me. I'll ask you first. What was your first impression of Troy when you met him? He was in my math class. Um, <sighs> math one sixty. No math. It was math one ten. Oh okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> right. Um, but um. Yeah, I thought he was a pretty cool guy. I wanted to get to know him more. He uh, mentioned that he played hockey in the class, doing our little first impression thing. Subtle, bro. <laughs> yeah, subtle, Brad. But I wanted to get to know him more and uh, see what he was like. And eventually, me and him started studying together. So, so it was a pretty, pretty decent first impression on your eyes. What was your first impression of Chris? Well, first impression had uh, probably be when all the freshmen met together with the captains. Um, Right in the beginning of the year, right before captain's practices, I think, and I just remember seeing Chris, and I was, you know, just wondering who he was. I, I didn't really have any, like, big thoughts going on, but uh, it's nice to get to know him, and now we're a so, nice uh, duo roommate group here. So. Well, it seems like things are going well. Obviously, you two are in the room, Boyd D. Clemente and Kyler Magus. Chris, who's the messiest in the room? Is it maybe you, maybe Troy, or maybe Kyler or Boyd? Jesus. Um, if I'm being honest, it's... It's probably me, but I have like, to agree with that one. yeah, yeah. My my side of the room is is pretty bad. You can take the blame, I guess. What Troy? Why is he so messy? You know why? Or is there something that sticks out the most? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess I'm pretty messy too. But the laundry though. I, yeah, there's, there's a nice <laughs> mount in the, in the back, like closet area that you, you, you're that's, always stepping over. And... That's mainly my. It's mainly my clothes. So, so I, well, anyways, I've, I've heard you guys have some sort of handshake. Would you mind showing me? Because I haven't seen this, but oh, yeah, no. let's let's right, see. I gotta right. back up here a little bit. All right, let's go. Okay, okay. <laughs> I, I I think that's like an eight eight out of ten. Where'd you guys Where'd you guys start that thing? From uh. <laughs> The 24-7 uh, Flyers Rangers. Okay. So way back still, then. Um, it's uh, uh, these two Flyers players. I don't even. I can't remember who they are. But was this when they were singing the yeah, the Mac the, Miller yeah, song? Yeah. So I was in. Okay, yeah, so I got gotcha. you. It's kind of stolen from that. But. Okay. Okay. Do you guys get copyrights for that, or do you just like you just <laughs> gonna steal? I mean, now people now people know, but like okay. before they didn't. But. All right, all right. Anyways, Chris. as always in this segment, we gotta ask who's the best looking on the team. Chris, who's the best looking on the team? I know it's tough. Trust me. Jesus <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with Drew. Like, uh, Draw Drew Clearman. Yeah. Okay. We got him last week. What? You, what? What are like? What are his biggest attributes? You think? Or should I say smallest? <laughs> I mean, he's pretty big for his size. Like, you know. I guess. Well, I guess we shouldn't be talking. What are you? Yeah. Five six. I'm maybe five seven on a good day. But Troy, who are you going with here? Uh I think I'll just go with uh, LaBelle. Oh, okay, no. LaBelle, yeah. yeah. He's, it, like, the guy's a celebrity around here. I think now that's, like, the second time we got him. But I want to hear your reasoning now as why Will LaBelle. I don't know. He just always looks like uh, best dress coming in. You know, he's always got the 
He just looks nice every time I see him. I don't know. All right, those, those Canadians, they're good looking, let me tell you. And uh, so that's biggest, that's the best looking on the team. Who's the biggest clown, Chris? Easily Cavs. Cavs? Well, yeah. what, we got a little explanation. I know he, remember when the, he did that little Fortnite dance? That's all he does. He just dances around. He just he tries to crack jokes at practice. He's a funny guy. Life of way, the way, way funnier than George. Oh, 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 oh I'll let that George about that one. You going with Cavs or you going with someone else? I'm going to have to go with Cavs, oh, too. Okay. The guy's always got a smile on his face walking in, and <laughs> I don't know. He's, he's always got these little comments that are pretty funny and he just gets you to laugh every day in the locker room. All right, well, we need we need some more laughs around here. We got to get Max Cavallini on the show or yeah, something like that, but guys, that's all the time we got today. Thanks so much. Awesome segment today. Thank you.